Selfsi, spoken easy language for social inclusion. Uh, I'm from Dyslexia organization in, in Malmo, and I have also been in a uh, uh, union uh, in Stockholm as a federal uh, corporation uh, in the FMLS. Hello. They call it the FMLS before, but it's Dyslexia Forbundet in Sweden. Yeah. yeah. So, yeah. Yeah, I'm so, so, and uh, it's not so easy. They start in uh, 1979 in as union as a dyslexia organization in Sweden. It uh, was a uh, started in uh, like this school, a uh, high school, as a folk high school in uh, Oppel in Sweden. So it was very difficult in the beginning and uh, was uh, also for us in Malmo when we started um, 30 years ago and was uh, two parents uh, have uh, kids in the uh, have dyslexia, so they have, and we have, we will, we would like to start uh, uh, a third town in Sweden must have uh, organizations uh, look after, uh, uh, look after the uh, uh, people with dyslexia. So we started. In the beginning, we have very difficult to. We uh, we accepted uh, with the uh, uh, Malmo city and uh, and we get no benefit. We get no bedrag, uh, so funding. Yeah, funding. Yeah, sorry, we get no funding for uh, our organization. So it takes uh, all, almost fifteen years work hard working, and uh, we have a. Uh, uh, lecture uh, and uh, help people run. Then suddenly we have accepted. So today we get uh, quite a lot of money, I think, from the city of Malmo. We get around 75,000 kronor. So a lot of, uh, lot of money to help others to. Uh, create and we have it today also uh, uh, lecture with some now with a uh, zoom and and we have also on the, on the place to folk come come here and we help them uh, we have also I have been here in this uh, school working in 20 years mm -hmm. uh, helping people with dyslexia and help them to uh, get a fair try to get the education to go on and uh, we I don't yeah when I translating them in my mind it's very <laughs> difficult to I have a strict line to in Sweden in Swedish, but when I go over to English, it's a little bit difficult. So I hope you accept that. So uh, yeah, and uh, we are in, we have been the in Malmo the almost the biggest local organization in in the Dusseldorf and uh, I don't know if today we are the biggest, but mm. I think Stockholm is also quite a big or a local organization in this league. So we are around 700, uh, 40, 40, 50 people, a lot of uh, members in our organization in Malmo. So uh, we are quite 
a lot as all of you. So because dyslexia have also been uh, shame, you're not talking about it. You don't see it. Doesn't uh, you're not marked in the front and or in the back. It says that you are dyslexia people. You are. You always find a way to a solution. Uh, find a way to do thing, things. We are a great, we are creative people. We find solution everywhere. So that has helped us to be be a very good organization. So that has not been easy. The organization also, not so, we are very young organization, so so uh, not so easy to uh, uh, get into the, uh, what do you say, in some health. In, integrated into society. Yeah, integrated in the side of society. So, uh, I think uh, we are quite a lot uh, of a lot of local organization in whole Sweden. We are quite a long country. So, uh, but we have some difficult today because we're not meeting. So, uh, junior pand pandemic, we have quite a lot difficult to organization of to uh, meet and have a, uh, uh, what do you say, some talk? Conversation. Conversation, yeah. yeah. And, and so, so then today we are going back again. We are meeting, we are physical meeting on the place. Also on the net, on the net and the web, web wide. So uh, we, we can say the pandemic has uh, get get you uh, other uh, tools to meet people and other uh, uh, other set of thinking. So you're thinking other way. Celsi. Spoken easy language for social inclusion. Partners are Zavo Trisa, RTV Slovenia, Dyslexi Verbundet, Università degli Studi di Pavia, Vieglas Valodas Agentura, Vilnius Universitetas, Vsi Informatio Scaupimo Irsklaidos Centras. Funded by the European Union.